Okay, I'm in Lane Bryant and this is my outfit for today. Okay, so this is from the Girls with Curves collaboration. Girl with Curves collaboration. This dress is a whopping $99. It is gorgeous though. Um, I like that it has an elastic here. I don't know if it would have fit right here if it didn't have an elastic. Um, the sleeves fit if it's in the arms, but if it was like an inch smaller, it would have been too tight. But it feels okay. Um, I like the lace detail, but I kind of wish it had softer lace. It doesn't feel as, sorry, it doesn't feel as expensive as it is lace-wise. Um, but yeah, this is a very sophisticated dress. Definitely an investment piece. perfect length um i read that you could probably also wear it open as like a duster i like that the buttons are concealed but there are a lot of buttons <laughs> i'll be right back so this one looked like it was open i didn't open it all the way because i don't have an undershirt so i'm not gonna expose my bra but it would be great as something over like a tight dress or something so I think it is lovely it's also lined so this arm part is the only part that's not lined okay never mind my leggings with this um this is a 28 I hate the shape I usually like shift dresses but this is doing nothing I like this detail, but it doesn't really lend to versatility. So yeah, especially for like 90 bucks, you suck. <laughs> okay, I love this top it is from the Girl With Curves line again. Super expensive though. For me, the sleeves are short. Um, a little tight, but not completely restricting. And it's long enough in the back. These are the modern stretch pants. I absolutely hate I hate this length. The lace at the bottom is cute. Um, I think these would be adorable for somebody who's short. Um, these don't work for me. They fit high. Which I love and the band is elasticated so it's very very comfortable if these were in a tall I would get them so that they fit like regular pants I don't like ankle pants on me oh my goodness I love the shape of this shirt do you see this? I got this in a 28 if it's perfectly. Everything was either 26, 28, or 28. This is 60 bucks. It feels um really good, like it's not super thin.
other than the black dress, this is my favorite. Oh, I need this in my closet. I love the shape. It goes good with the green, but like I said, I'm just trying on tops now. I don't like these pants, but it goes good with green. <laughs> oh my God, I love this top. Okay, um, this is cute. I like the embellishment and the super long sleeves, but I feel like it looks weird with the cow neck and the opening. So if there was no opening, it would be cute. And it's not too, too thin, but it's not super thick either. Oh, and I was going to try on these, but they are not super stretch because I can't get them on. I'm not quite at 28. It's like 28 is too small, but 30 is too big. Um, but yeah, the ankle on this is super skinny, so I couldn't get it on. Yeah. So yeah, I still want more thicker sweaters. This is like medium. Okay, so I just wanted to try on a blazer. I know that my bust hasn't gone down, so in blazers I'm usually a 30 or towards six. This is a 28. I love the buttons. I like the shape it gives, but of course it's too small. Um, it has a lot of stretch, but um, it doesn't look like cheap or amateurish. But yeah, the buttons are my favorite part. So I just took my dress and tucked it in to make it look like a blouse. But yeah, it's super cute. Definitely something I would add to my wardrobe if it fit. But yeah, those are all the pieces that I tried on today. Hopefully this was somewhat informative. Um, the girls with curves, the girl with curves line has some cute pieces. I think they're overpriced though, cause it's not like they're super luxe, but they are cute. And if this dress ever goes on clearance, I'd be the first person to buy it. I loved it. And I got my eye on this shirt. <laughs> Alright, bye.